that matters. You're watching KLBK News at Noon. Welcome back on in KLBK News at Noon. So normally we do a little story right here, but I do have a little sad news at noon for the wonderful folks who join me here on the show every day. You know, I've... Um, I've had some folks come up to me over the years and say, you know, we watch you. You're not going to be leaving anytime soon, are you? You know, there's there's turnover in any job. And I haven't had any reason to leave at all. But, you know, I also work the 6 a.m. show. 3 a.m. is early, and my alarm clock does need a good long vacation at the beach. So I'm going to take a break with it. Uh, it does, it breaks my heart. Think about not being here with the KLUK family and the community I love every day. Uh, somebody did tell me though the other day, it's such a huge privilege, uh, apparently I am the longest running morning anchor here on KLBK Morning and New, which is such a huge blessing. Uh, my KLBK family here at the station, phenomenal. Uh, you, the folks who join us every day, still just surreal to me. I remember when leadership said about half a decade ago, uh, it was just as surreal then as it is now because being in my home community, trying to give back to the people who raised me, there is just no greater privilege. And uh, as for what's next, you know, I graduated from Texas Tech, Reckham. So uh, it's a bit of a full circle moment. I'll uh, join their Mass Comm College to help transition graduates to careers. We'll be focused on getting Mass Comm resources out to strengthen the community. Now I'll still be reachable on my Facebook page. It is right there. So please don't hesitate to send a message um, I will be with you today and then tomorrow. So tomorrow, Tuesday, will be my last day. Now, I told Chris Whited, he's over there listening, uh, not to celebrate too much. So y'all, please, please hold him to that. <laughs> so uh, we'll be right back with him and uh, a look at our forecast.